Welcome back to another week of Instagram stories. Man, I don't know how many I've gone through already. What is this, 36, 37? Anyways, it's a lot of weeks. I don't know, what does that mean? Did that, that mean that there's like uh, about 14 weeks left in the year or something like that? I don't know. Anyways, I'm not so good with math. Neither is my horse. But what does it matter? You're not here for math. You're here to watch me during the week or whatever it is you're here for. But anyways, um, you guys already know the drill. Um, in order to watch these uh, best, watch them on your phone or on your tablet somewhere where it's uh, horizontal. I mean vertical instead of horizontal. So that way you can uh, see it and it's all its glory. Um, and yeah, that's about it. I think that's enough of an intro today. So without further ado, my week in Instagram stories. Oh, that means I got to cut it here. Good morning, everybody. I've already been so freaking busy. I didn't even have time to make my coffee. That's why I'm making it now. Not because I woke up late. None of that. I've actually, I've actually been pretty busy already this morning. Uh, just making my coffee. I had to make a phone call back home because it's my little niece's uh, birthday today. I think she's like eight. <laughs> I suck at this. I know. All right. That's why I'm the fun uncle. But uh, what else? Also, looking at the calendar here, it seems like we're only. Uh, just like two weeks away from Halloween and the Day of the Dead, which is in two weeks of the weekend. So yeah, the next two weeks, Thursday, says here, it's Halloween. Then it says, and it's the Day of the Dead stuff, and I can't wait for that. It's going to be a lot of fun. Me and my girlfriend are going to be doing all the cool, fun stuff. We're going to be bringing the cameras, uh, bringing some friends, and uh, it's going to be really cool. I'm going to actually get to experience the whole, you know, Day of the Dead thing like a real bona fide Mexican. That's right. All right, you know, just to use, you know, doing some uploads. You already know the drill. Just uh, about to get um, some dinner ready. Fucking starving. I usually eat a little later, but I'm just really hungry. Look at that. I got me some hot dogs. I'm gonna cook me some hot dogs. Um, we're running out of bread, so I'm just gonna have to have have some cut up hot dogs. And then, you know, with some onions and some ketchups and all that good stuff. Uh, and then uh, we got some beans. You know, we got some of these beans. You know, I love these beans. These are so great. They're like 75 cents and they're just like awesome. They have like everything you want in them. You know, the pork, uh, the goodies, the awesomeness. Uh, it's just really good. I mean, fuck. Um, it literally, it, it's, um, I, love, I, I make beans sometimes, but, you know, this is like very budget friendly. And then, yeah, here are the onions I got cut up. So I'm going to use that with some, uh, you know, cooked up with some eggs. You know, scramble some eggs. And uh, with, you know, with the onions. So, you know, then the little grease. See, the grease is left over there. I put some oil in there and some olive oil. And then the grease from the hot dogs, they slowly cook. I use that for the onions. I saute the onions and then I add the eggs. I make some scrambled eggs and then I got some eggs, some beans, some cut up hot dogs. And, you know, what more do you need, right? And then that's it. You know, it's nice. Pretty healthy meal, you know, these are like, I try to get the best hot dogs out there possible, and you know, whatever, it is what it is, alright, gotta go. Yeah, you know, I decided to do the math on dinner real quick, just, you know, for the purposes of uh, the video. Um, and everything came out to like around 80 pesos, which is around $4, or $4 for dinner. And a lot of times, when I order food, you know, to come to my house, you know, delivered, like tacos and all that shit, it's like around $6 give or take and sometimes like last night I ordered something because it was a special and I got it for two dollars I sorry my finger slipped but like I was saying the whole two dollar thing um, that's just like a rare thing it was like a promotion but still I got like a lot of food like really good food they usually cost like ten dollars for like around two dollars so that's pretty good but even so sometimes like uh, you know the food delivery that's like around six dollars it's again just the cheaper tacos just regular you know cheap food that's good food but sometimes you know uh, for the most part it's like around eight dollars ten dollars tops 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 and so yeah that about equals my food budget per the per day it's like around four dollars at the cheapest you know uh to ten dollars at the most expensive and then even if i have a snack it's no more than a dollar or two period that's it Yeah, I'm not sure if you guys can see that out there, but uh, it was raining. Uh, I woke up this morning with rain. It was raining really, really hard this morning, and uh, 
I kept snuggled in bed, uh, and then I realized, oh shit, I, it's late. And I woke up, and it's still raining, and it's nice and chill and relaxed. But you know, the good thing is why I let myself so my, why I let myself sleep in a little bit is because I already finished most of my work. I caught up, even though this week was crazy busy, new clients, new everything, tons of projects, a whole nine. You know, usually what that does is just make me work harder. So you know, now Friday morning. I'm pretty much done with all my work, at least for now, and so I'm just going to, you know, have my coffee, chillax, start editing another Cuba video, and just, you know, relax and enjoy my Friday morning. Hope you guys are doing the same. Yeah, it's still raining out, but it's okay. It's a perfect day to stay in and uh, do some home cooking. Look at that. I'm making some meatballs. Look at that. Because I'm going to make some spaghetti and meatballs for dinner tonight. Because it's uh, nice and rainy and, you know, it's just like a nice little cozy meal type of thing, you know. Uh, that me and Christian are going to have uh, later tonight. Hope you guys are having a wonderful start to your weekend as well. Even if, if it starts off to be rainy or something like that. Look at that lovely loveliness. Look at that, even more lovely loveliness right here. <laughs> hey guys, how's it going? And welcome back. Happy Monday. Hope you guys are having an amazing Monday morning already. I know I am. I can barely get this uh, crazy hair together. But anyways, so far so good. Just, uh, you know, doing the usual Monday morning routine. Getting that coffee ready. I was, I was going a little sluggish. And I was wondering to myself, man, what the hell's going on? And they're like, oh yeah, that's right. I haven't had enough, I haven't had any coffee today, so, you know, I'm just making the coffee now about, you know, two hours into my morning, and that's it, you know, right now I'm just uh, about to get my morning started, I got a bunch of videos to edit, I got a very, very busy week again this, this week coming up, I got um, a, a video shoot on Wednesday, so I'm, I'm going to be gone for the most part on Wednesday, not only do I have, uh, you know, my live stream, but after the live stream I got to go do a video shoot, so I'm kind of booked for that whole day. And Thursday, I got dinner with some friends, and uh, today's Monday, so we got work, Tuesday, more work, Friday, work, and then fun, and all that good stuff. And uh, and also, I had a lot of fun this weekend, and I can't wait to share it with you guys uh, in the next coming days, because uh, as you guys know, whenever I have a lot of fun, I usually tend to record it. So, you know, I did a lot of recording on Sunday. We went to a, a local flea market all the way at the south of the city, which is amazing, and I can't wait to share that with you. And uh, just stay tuned, because it'll come out by Saturday. I know, I'm not proud of it, but you know, sometimes we're hungry and sometimes we gotta eat leftover cold pizza as you're cleaning out the fridge for the garbage guy. You know. Alright, time for round dos. Dos, that's uh, two in Spanish. You already know the drill. Coffee time! Yeah! There we go. Oh crap, I just forgot the sugar. Crap! Okay, okay, I did not forget the sugar. It was in there already, I just didn't really see it. My hair is all messed up. See, this is what happens when uh, your office is downstairs and you live upstairs. See? Hey, actually, it's not so bad. Sometimes my girl puts my hair like that and uh, she says it looks sexier. I don't know. Whatever. Hey, whatever tickles her pickle. But anywho, um, yeah, just uh, getting round two of coffee. Um, got a lot of things to do left. I'm, you know, it's funny because like uh, a lot of times when I have like a little bit of brain fart when I'm talking to you guys, I just re-record it. But this time I'm just going to leave it there. That was uh, real life uh, me. Oh my God, look at that. Is that a bag floating behind me? All right, got to go. Back to work. You know, as I was re looking back at what I just recorded and posting it, I was like, holy shit. I was more distracted there than Homer Simpson normally is. You know, li literally... In the last three posts, I got distracted like 15 different times. I 15. What the hell is that? Man, I gotta start waking up earlier. It's already 9:15. I've already been up for like an hour and a half, and um, I'm I barely just getting my coffee ready. Hot, done. Oh my god, I need my coffee. Fucking hot. Ah. Anyways, but like I was saying, I think you guys are actually watching my Instagram videos, or you guys are watching something, because every single morning I wake up and it's like I have more emails, more messages more voicemails more whatever everything and it's uh 
you know, at first it was a little overwhelming, but it's actually pretty fucking cool now, man. It really is. It's like, it's almost like a bona fide business. Every time I wake up now, it's like I got all kinds of clients, you know, about with all kinds of things. And look, even my calendar is all filled up with all kinds of things. I already got the next month starting to fill up. It's great stuff, man. Great stuff with all kinds of things, by the way. I mean, seriously, I'm super crazy excited. I'm even crazier excited to get back to work today because... I got some really fun videos um, I'm editing and uh, coming up in the next few days. So, you know, just uh, stay tuned for those. Literally, on Thursday, um, what did I do Thursday? I forgot. Oh, yeah. We went to have breakfast at some boutique hotel. And then on Friday and Saturday, you're going to see El Megado de San Roque. And we're going to have food porn on Saturday. It's just fucking amazing. And like I said, I'm editing the videos myself. And, like, I can't wait to, to like, publish them so you guys can see all the cool stuff and fun stuff that, you know, I'm always doing out here because it just keeps getting funner and better and awesomer every day. Also, on top of everything else, it's incredibly unseasonably hot. Like, last night it was like 88 degrees. This morning I'm already sweating balls again. It's kind of weird. It's, it's a weird climate now all of a sudden. It seems to... Some, some days it seems to be cool and cool down a little bit. Then other days it's like scorching hot, crazy humid. It almost feels like fall. Or almost like if September was like a month late, but eh, whatever. It is what it is. It is cooling down though. Hey. Oh, right. And the last thing, please, it's Tuesday. Go to my channel and go check out today's Cuba video upload. All right. Every single Tuesday, I do a Cuba video upload that I did from, uh, you know, that I recorded on my last trip to Cuba. So please go check it out. All right. It's really fun, really cool. And today's adventure, we went to, where did we go? Oh yeah, we went to the pharmacy museum in, uh, in La Habana and we also got peanuts and food and all that good stuff. So go check it out. It was cool and fun. And for those of you guys that don't know already, it's literally Jose Ortega on YouTube. Just type in Jose Ortega on YouTube or go to joseartega.com or you can just click the link in the description of my Instagram profile. All right, I feel real accomplished. I just finished editing three whole videos of uh, my adventure, you know, on Sunday uh, with me, Christian, and uh, my good friend John that came down to visit. And um, yeah, so we went to uh, so we went to a Mexican flea market, most specifically in Megado San Roque, all the way to the south of the city. And man, it was really fun and uh, really cool. In fact, the, um, I got to film so much that I made two episodes. So. On Friday, you're going to have uh, the um, actual flea market episode of um, me showing you guys around the flea market. And on Saturday, it's the food porn episode. It's just all food all the time. Street food in the market. So now, as I upload the videos, I'm going to go and uh, see if I can film uh, Monday Motivation while I go to the store to go pick up some onions and a couple other things I got to pick up at the little store. So, you know, just... Trying to kill as many birds with as one stone as possible. I don't know what the fuck I'm saying. Uh, oh, yeah, multitasking. Yeah, that's what I was trying to say. Yeah, just try to multitask. You know, sometimes I'm trying to multitask so much that just like you saw there, I, I can't even speak with English. Gotta go. Look at that. What do you think about that? Not only did I shoot Monday Motivation and run my errands, but I'm already done editing it and everything. So... Bam, like a boss. I want to do a quick poll because I'm curious as hell. I'm not sure if the FBI, NSA are looking after me. Anyways, do you guys have like a weird black background or like a dark mode on your Instagram at night? Or is it just me? Mucho good morning, guys. How's it going? Oh, hey, how's it going? I feel better. So, yeah, sorry. I was speaking a little weird until I had my coffee. Now I can speak less weird anyways i know you guys woke up this morning you know just crazy ready you know you logged on to your youtubes you know the whole nine you know because you want to hang out with me today right live on youtube right at 11 a.m eastern correct nobody wants to hang out with you they want to hang out with me yeah well whatever regardless if you want to hang out with either me or lambo or both of us then just uh you know, click the link in the description of my Instagram profile that will take you straight to my YouTube page. And then there, there'll be a thing that says click here to go live. And then, anyways, just go to my page and uh, I'll see you guys in a few minutes. All right, so I just finished my live stream. See? 
still processing. And I always get this every single time. Every single time I finish a live stream, I always get that. And it kind of sucks because it's like I'm, I'm just censored right off the bat. You know? Anyway, so I'm going to show you what I do here. Let me see if I can show you. So we go to request review. It's a process, all right? So you got to click on request review. And then you got to go through here. So like request review. All right? See? And that's it. That's the review process. And that's basically it right there. So you pretty much just saw me um, ask YouTube to please... To please, you know, um, allow me to monetize my video because, you know, they, they don't like my live stream. I guess I go a little bit too hog wild on, on the live streams. Well, I got my phone out and I realized, you know what? Let me film a little Instagram story real quick of what I'm doing. So, look, I'm out here on the scene. I'm doing a video shoot for somebody. I'm also going to be making a video for the channel. I'm also hoping this guy stops making noise before he gives me a headache not that it fucking matters because i'm gonna be putting music to what i'm shooting but anyways i'm in a local um bed and breakfast and i'm gonna be doing a promo video for their hotel and you know just stay tuned to the actual channel for more information on that but again i'm here filming that too while i'm out filming the other stuff so yeah you know just a day in the life uh hope you guys are having a wonderful wonderful hump day out there too and so I, I had to go and do some filming of a, well, you guys already know, I had to go film something. I just had to go do some filming, and um, I couldn't do any filming because not only was it cloudy, but it was raining and raining really hard, and it was still raining. And then even, even after I was about to leave, I couldn't leave, it started storming and raining, and it's like, just one of those days, shit happens, man, you know, so just, you know, again, I'm just letting you guys know, to let you guys know that I also have shitty days, and shit also happens, things that are out of my control, but you know what? The one thing I can control is my actual emotions and how I feel about this and what I'm going to do about it and all that other good stuff. So, you know what I'm going to do now? I'm just going to fucking take a shower, smoke a fat blunt, and um, just focus on some other shit. Yeah, so to give you guys a little bit more context. So, I showed up in the afternoon to get some shots with the sun. As soon as I got there, it got really cloudy and all of a sudden, you know, it started to drizzle a little bit but just kept getting cloudier and everything had shadows and it was dark and it was like man this sucks then it started raining really hard and i'm like oh fuck well i had to do something nearby and i was like well fuck it i'll leave my camera equipment i'll go meet with this other person and i'll come back and i'll film what i gotta film at night and sh i mean it looks like it's you know when i was looking at the sky it was clearing up i could see some blue skies in the late afternoon and i'm like ah, oh, well fuck it at least i can salvage the night part of it so I go do that i come back and when i come back to start filming the night stuff literally as the darkness started coming as it started getting dark outside all of a sudden like thunder and rain and just like rough like cats and dogs and then i had to wait like another hour and a half so it stopped raining stopped flooding so i can call my uber so i can bring my fat ass home you want to hear the cruelest part of the whole thing you hear anything silence yeah guess what it stopped raining all around so i probably should have stayed and filmed the night stuff right now even though Things would have been wet and um, might not have looked as good. I'm glad I didn't stay and I didn't film anything right now. But, you know, I just... I'm frustrated. I need my blunt. I need a shower. All right? I, uh, <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> All right, guys. Rant officially over. I just had to vent a little bit because, you know... Again, just to let you guys know and remind you guys that, you know, even shit happens in my life and... Uh, Things aren't perfect in my life, and it's all about, you know, making the best of it, and that's basically it. I mean, at the end of the day, you know, these are the fuels to my Monday motivations, the fuels to a lot of the things that I do. You know, as uh, as pissed off and frustrated as I am right now, I'm also very proud of myself for not going on ahead and filming today regardless of the weather because i could have easily filmed and gone through the whole thing and made it happen but then the product would have been inferior and really crappy so i said to myself i made an executive decision to start from scratch and just you know literally um come back another day with full on sun so i can do the job right 
and um, and go with that. And that's it. And even though all, all the frustration came from me trying to just salvage this and salvage this and salvage this, when right from the get-go, I should have known better and known that I just had to start from the beginning. Now, again, it wasn't a total loss. Not only did I learn a lesson and uh, I got a little bit lay of the land of uh, as to what I'm going to be doing um, you know, for filming next time I go over there. And I also got to do a little side job and make some money. And so it all worked out in the end. But still... You know, only because I chose to make this a learning experience and I chose to make this a positive experience instead of, you know, still being very frustrated and, and pissed off and the whole fucking thing. And yeah, I still haven't smoked my blunt, so I need to go do that now. Hey guys, how's it going? Well, guess what? After much debate this morning, the sun decided to partially come out. See, there's still some clouds. Might be getting cloudier. Uh, but regardless, um, no rain for the foreseeable future. So I'm going to play it you know i'm gonna fucking risk it all and i'm gonna fucking go all the way over there and see if i can get the shots that i need um without uh, much trouble all right because otherwise um it seems like you know i was looking at the weather and it seems like it's gonna be a lot of rain and clouds coming for the foreseeable future so if i don't fucking go now you know who knows when i'm gonna be able to go so all right guys without further well i'm gonna get out of here because my uber's already here so smell you later alligators so, i'm out here doing my work Trying to get some final shots of this building right here. I'm um, trying not to get run over by the buses coming my way. Look how close I am to the road here. So yeah, you know, just another day. Just another day out here. Getting it. All right, I'll catch you guys in a little bit, all right? Well, I was gonna call myself an Uber. But I decided to just walk home, get some exercise, do all that good stuff. I still had some energy left in me. So I was like, you know what? Fuck it. Let's drain the fucking tank. Let's do this. So, you know, I'm out here walking in the sun. Not like the song Walking on the Sun. Walking under the sun. There you go. <laughs> and now I'm just, you know, doing some uh, some heavy, some lifts here. Some, uh, you know, I got my camera equipment behind me. And that's it, you know, we're just uh, doing it. That's it. I mean, it's really not that, that I mean, for real, it's like, um, I'm not a workout kind of guy, so I just force myself to work out. So, like, now, it's like instead of doing the Uber and taking the easy way out, you know, what am I doing? You already know what's up. You know, I'm walking home. Why not? You know? I could take the bus. I could take an Uber, but it's like, no, let's, let's do this. Let's walk. All right, my, my arm's getting tired. I gotta go. <laughs> Oh man, see, look, I forgot to let go of the button here, so now I gotta talk a little more. But, anyways, yeah, my, my, now this arm's getting tired, so now I gotta switch over. I gotta switch arms, alright? I gotta get back to, back to working out. Alright, talk to you later, guys. This has been a very, very busy week for me. Um, I'm already back home, I'm already showered, dressed, I already finished meeting number two, and um, now I'm just like literally working on the computer. Um, in fact, I'm finishing up uh, this week in Instagram stories so that I can. Uh, do you know uh, process the video and upload it along with the other uploads uh, so that I can finish with that and I can get ready for my meeting later tonight actually I'm just having dinner tonight with some uh, with a friend and uh, and Christian and all that good stuff but it's still kind of a meeting kind of like a whatever you know uh, but regardless my hair is doing this funky thing I don't know what the hell's going on it's been acting weird the last couple of days but I gotta fix that but anyways while I fix that, I'm gonna see if I can get back to work because as you guys already know, I gotta finish this up and I uh, gotta do a bunch of other shit while I wait for my friend to show up. Uh, because once they show up, uh, taco time. All right, I'll see you guys later. Bye. Well guys, I hope you guys enjoyed another week of Instagram stories. Now, um, in case you were just watching the whole thing, which I'm sure you have because you're watching this now. Um, yeah, I'm wearing the same shirt as I did in my last story. And yeah, if you guys are, you know, um, any Sherlock Holmes out there, then yes, I did record my last Instagram story right before I started recording this. So, yeah, good job, guys. Good job. All right, <laughs> enough of my shenanigans. No more horsing around crickets. All right, anyways, guys, thanks again for watching. You already know the drill. Don't forget to please like, please subscribe, please share, please hit that bell icon. Thanks again for, for being here as always. And uh, you already know the drill. If you guys want to see these live as I post them or make them, just, you know, follow me on Instagram. Also, check out the Discord. Don't forget to do all that other stuff. All the links are at the bottom. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you guys 
next week or tomorrow. Actually, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.